the senior women's national football team have been preparing for upcoming matches against Puerto Rico. They play at home on Friday and then away to their opponents on Sunday as qualifying for the Women's Gold Cup is at stake. Ken Fuentes has more. Coming up against St. Augustine's secondary in a practice match, the senior women's team took the lead on a goal that would leave anyone impressed. They then extended that lead, scoring at the end of a corner. St. Augustine, not wanting to be outdone by the national women's team, had their chances. Their persistence speed off as they cut into the senior women's team lead. The Green Machine boys then found the equalizer against the women's team. Two all at the break. Speaking on the team's preparation, head coach Hurd says he does not expect an easy game against Puerto Rico on Friday. In the Puerto Ricans, we've seen them. Um, I was able to see several of their games actually, including the, uh, their game against uh, Mexico. Um, they are a decent team. I think they are very technical players. Uh, more or less, uh, the team uh, consists of players uh, that come out of the U.S. collegiate system. So you yeah, expect them to be technical, but of course we would have um, we would have seen certain things that we feel like we could exploit, and we are looking to do that on Friday. Hood is hoping for a good crowd at the Hazley Crawford Stadium on Friday to motivate the girls. He adds he would have liked some more international games for his team, but understands the circumstances that they face. We are in a position where we know that there is always going to be a difficulty in getting um, international games, friendly internationals. Uh, we tried, but we weren't able to secure any. Um, so this is what, this is going to be our second outing against a boys team. We try to compensate for the international t uh, game uh, uh, against boys that we feel would probably give us the kind of uh, opposition that we, would, we expect to get um, in the, the real game when it, when it comes on, on Friday and Sunday. He hopes that after the upcoming matches, the team will be in a position of being qualified for the next round of competition. We have these two games and we hope that by the end of these two games, um, our fate will be determined positively in that we know that going into the Mexico game, we have already qualified for the, the pre-tournament, um, the Gold Cup pre-tournament, where we have to play uh, one of the top teams in League B to qualify for the, 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 uh, the Gold Cup proper. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports. Make sure and head out to support the ladies, all right?